then eventually oh, KOE just started winning. <laughs> Going Peach. But I actually like more. Yeah, no. Oh I'd... my god, crowd cancel. A 40%. Although, um, the battlefield definitely. Oh, no jump? Uh, no jump on Fox? I do agree with this stage choice because uh, in their winner's side set, uh, after Lu after winning game one, they went to FD on the Fox's pick and then counterpicked it again to FD. I kind of get like that salty run back, but they did yeah. so much better on a stage like Battlefield. They could have picked like a Battlefield again, and they picked yeah. like Smashville to get a platform in the mix. There's so many better things they could have done counterpicked wise. Yeah. I hope they rectify this. We're not going to kill Peach. We're going to kill Fox probably. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, never mind. What a safe day. The, the thing is, though, that I, love, I love that all the foxes now are pulling off the ice left and like, yeah. I'm gonna up B and let you hit my up B. See, now, the way. scary part about that is when you're one fox is off stage, you're putting the other one off stage, and it's like you could just both die. Yeah, like if, if for some reason King of Evil decides to get like really randy and just throws out like a down a, a down B like yeah. off stage, you're both dead. <laughs> There's no coming back. From that. They stand down smash. I love it. Yep. Oh, is that there to jab and then count smash? Yeah. That was pretty good looking. I, I mentioned it earlier, but like, Tony, oh. Tony's, uh, he's just like, so much more. Definitely put in that time. Sorry. Oh, good. Fortunately, uh, with a team like this, uh, both characters have a very, very long recovery, so it's gonna be pretty rough overall. Yeah. Like when one gets knocked off stage, either Gan or Peach. The other one's just gonna be forced to go. They have to do their best to like either separate or like recognize they're in a 2v1. Do their best to not take it. Fox is uh, not too far behind. One solid hit away from taking out the Ganondor. But the Ganondor back air kills him at 82. Foxes are hit. getting dribbled. And HMO 4 uh, just a little off. I think he like air dodged off stage. Got to stop early. No. That bitch. Uh, well, if he has these like that, that means the lead is kind of diminished. Oh, he just he oh, drilled but he grabs and then, ledge. Yeah, because I, I think he got shined by Andre. That pushed him to ledge? Yeah, it did. Oh, I did not like that by King of Evil. Putting yourself off stage and Gandorf against like Spacey. Okay, I guess it worked out, I guess, because. Yeah, because Envoy. Envoy, Envoy just, shined Anthony, yeah. Did I yeah. Try to go for both of them, but uh, when you're down stocks. Envoy looking like a pancake getting flipped up. <laughs> That was too oh. That was too good. There you go. It was like the first time. All hitboxes. Yeah, oh, oh, yeah. I actually like that dash tag, but H104 uh, definitely was a little too antsy on that part. I think he just didn't expect the yep. dash tag because he there you go. saw the gear. It was like waiting so long. Probably oh, yeah. Oh, show just, wins it. Yeah. I think he might have been a touch low, too. This game's winner is... Okay, so, game one going about as well as it did in the winner's side set. However, the two games on FD, yeah. they did end up pulling it back. The question is, they left FD open again. Three, First question is why? <laughs> well, no, I think this is like okay for Spacey's. It's definitely not good, but it's like they're still a great character with a great neutral, right? Oh, and we're actually seeing uh, Falco. Guys, yeah. Uh, they actually lost the first game inside Falco Fox, and then they switched to Double Fox, and uh, they won two sets on it, two games on it. Yeah. yeah. I definitely do not agree with this. Uh, I don't like the stage choice. I don't know why you would force yourself to go to FD. Maybe because I think they, like, they beat him last time. They did. But, like, FD is definitely, there's better stages for you. I'm yeah. not sure exactly what they banned FD. Uh, they banned, I think, Wario, and then Pokemon Stadium. Which I agree with the Pokemon Stadium pick purely yeah. as a player ban. Because, just personally, whenever I play Envoy, I just ban Pokemon Stadium too. Yeah, and it's a very good Fox stage too. Yeah, it's been incredible. When people ban against Envoy, it's not quite not necessarily because it's banned. Just because if, if he wasn't playing Fox, it's not a scary stage. Actually, but even then, like, like out of all like, the good Fox stages, like, Envoy is the most yes. beautiful on PS2. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah, you're right. Oh. Here, we got doubles and we've got Sparta Kicks coming out. Nice. This is a little bit of a lead right now. Kind of, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> kind of, never mind. That's the, that's the story of this match. It's like, you oh. think it's going one way, and then like, one team just pulls it back. I think it would have been great if uh, maybe we'll threw Honorable off offstage over there. Oh, yeah. the double down smash. I think it would have made more sense. Offstage? Oh, I know. Throw him, back throw him. Back throw him, and then worst, best case scenario, you force an edge guard yeah. and get it. Kill both of them. Nice. Worst case scenario, you just force a 2v1. Build up percent on that Falco. 
Oh, and that's gonna be a thing. Uh, yeah, they can do. I definitely agree with uh, the Falco, just because I feel like comfort wise, there's no comfortable character overall. But I feel like this puts him in that weird scenario of they picked FD, but now they're limiting themselves on escape options on the platform. You know, the Falco's gonna get punished like yeah. super hard if he gets punched. And you know what it is, man? Daddy Felix single style with Falco is a uh, zoning of laser. So he, he plays around like his, his lasers and shoots. And it's not necessarily he can work in doubles. Why might it seem like they didn't do as well with Falco? Because Fox is just a little easier playing doubles. Like, what you do, like, because at least Falco lasers, you can't just spam because your partner runs into them, you know? But, uh. I mean, right Falco, now, Falco, I feel like in this case, and like, honestly, with their set with, uh, you and Boo, actually, on it, they just switched Falco. I felt like they needed that projectile pressure to come out to help them with it. But, I don't know. I just, I feel like if you play Falco correctly, he's definitely a better support character than regular Falco. Yeah. Just because I feel like if you're if you're playing around your teammate well enough with clickers, you shouldn't have to worry about small like Fox nice pressure. Good boy. I'm alive. Oh, and Hagen was getting a little too uh a little too pillar happy. I can't really do that in doubles. I can first Oh, and that's gonna oh, he's gonna stop. take. He's gonna take a stop. This is one to and one right this now. This is exactly what uh, the team is gonna do. They definitely don't want the Peach. They have so much long. It's basically much better yeah. on that We saw Garrett. We saw Garrett get uh, you know games like, earlier on in their winter set. Oh, and, and there it is. Looking Garrett. like it right now. Oh, and there goes the Peach. Back here. Oh, oh, there's the down smash. Oh, this is it. Will they learn? Well, they learned. Maybe I'm not sure they were on the back. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I do not think the they were on the, the right choice. Like, yeah, you don't have Dreamland. You're probably not going to have Delfino or Pokemon. Actually, yeah, no, they're going to ban like probably going to ban Falcon. Yeah. Or you know, because it deal with like weird move. Yeah. So I don't expect an MP counter pick. A bit too. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I think but like honestly, I, I think. I don't uh, like that stage though. What, with Delfinos or FOD? No, 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 FOD. FOD is I'm very good for Peach. I think, I actually, yeah, okay, yeah. yeah. Okay, so Peach, uh, and Boar, both like, and Boar, both drive so hard on the stage, they have to stay together. Right now, that's it, that's it, kind of my issue in a lot of times. Both of these teams are each other with it. I feel like yeah. giving them most, even less space to work with, it could go either way. Either they figure out their spacing, so little area. To or they can get the Oh, he has a terrible angle. Oh, but living still. Box privilege. Is there ledge? Yeah, so right now, what we're seeing right now is like, the why the stage is so good because the platform can really help out. When, when a space you get stuck on a, on a platform, he's just in a rough spot, right? So he's like, definitely not in the spot you want to be in. So, and, and so, so you're probably going to get hit. And when you get hit by these characters, you get set at terrible angles. Especially with, like, if, like say, like, yeah, the space animals are on the platform, but even then, like, Peach ends up on a platform or Ganon ends up on a platform, they're not as rough off. Because Peach has, you know, the equalizer more to run the fox. Each one works down if you stop right there. Fox and stuff. Oh, it's going to be a bad angle. Yeah, yeah it's going to be it. Honestly, uh, the King of Evil is like, hurting yeah. That's definitely like the big like equalizer. Because yeah. the teams are relatively equal and edge guarding um, red team are giving them like slow. Where they missed that a bit more uh, on FD. Probably was the That was probably the difference. Oh, but the red <laughs> down to me almost came to the stock at 81. Oh no. I'm the from this. Oh, nice save and game. Good choice to jump out of that, but unfortunately, such a precarious position. And right now, each team is down six and six dots. It's doable, because they actually had a really good comeback last game. But, uh. But given the stage, yeah. a lot rougher. But I think they need to do is they need to be. They need to be cleaning up these Yeah, they also they have to start 2v1ing. When they hit someone high, 
They're, they're more so looking to discharge that player instead of truly wanting a team. Playing a team. They're looking for some. That's the problem. That's what boss team. That's that's the problem. This team's just devolve into one. I'm gonna play singles over here, you play singles over there, and hopefully this works. That, like, that's what separates great teams, good teams from great teams, honestly. Great teams are the ones who are very Yeah, sure, put two, two good players together. Uh, but why aren't the two best players in Melee it's the best level team? No? Why is it Armada Android or S Fat and uh, Q Fat? Uh, yeah, or Q Q and S Fat. Which is why, because they play insanely well double. Not that the other teams have bad teams, like the aspect of doubles are there is like you know dealt with much much better by the good team. Hi kids, you gotta oh. play to each other's strength and cover each other's weaknesses. Yeah, this is kids 3D game I've over. I've seen with Gare for a while. I soon realized that yeah, he is terrible at team combos. Oh no, he do it yourself. <laughs> he, he's, he's, like, he's like, I'm gonna stand over here and I'm gonna do some Ganondorf stuff. Oh, that's it. Yeah. Yep. Gonna be uh, two one on the other side. Winner is uh, moving into grand finals. All right, that's me. Luck out there, my friend.